Uh, the survey for the large manufacturers index is for the Tankan to come in uh, minus 14, which will be uh, 11 points stronger than the previous survey three months ago. And the figures are just in bang in line with forecasts, uh, minus 14. So that's an improvement of 11 points from the previous survey and the best result in 18 months, which is uh, when Lehman Brothers went bust and that sent the world into a global recession. A lot of reasons why uh, the pessimism is getting smaller and smaller. One reason is that uh, exports are now back finally to pre-Lehman shock levels, rising 45 percent last month. There are still a few problems, of course. Deflation in Japan, a big drag on earnings for the domestic players. And if we look at the large non-manufacturers index, actually sentiment improving to minus 14 from minus 22 in the previous survey. That's a lot better than the forecast. The forecast minus 18. So the non-manufacturers uh, are getting least pessimistic. Now, I should point out these are both negative readings, and a negative reading means that there are more people who are pessimistic than optimistic about the outcome. Uh, given the outlook, the outlook uh, in three months' time for large manufacturers, they're saying that things are going to improve from minus 40 now to minus 8. So still pessimism continuing, but we're starting to get back to a positive figure. We have had a positive reading uh, uh, since June of 2008. We'll take a quick look at how the market's reacting. Singapore futures for the Nikkei, 11,120. We closed yesterday at 11,089, 11,090, give or take. So we're looking for a rise in the Nikkei. Uh, the yen trading at 93.62, uh, the euro 126.60. Uh, one other figure that's very important is the CapEx figure. Uh, we are seeing companies planning to cut spending by four tenths of one percent in the business year that starts today. That's a big improvement from the last tank count when they said they were going to cut spending by 13.8 percent. But the fact remains, companies still aren't ready to increase spending.